Good morning and welcome to Monday Minutes with Kelly and Jesse. My name is Kelly. And my name is Jesse. And this week we're going to show you how to find videos, tutorials, blog posts, and everything education that you're looking for uh, when it comes to Koha. Yeah, great. Um, we're sharing the screen and we're right on our Bywater website. So if you all don't have that bookmarked, <laughs> um, stop the video and go bookmark it so you have this opportunity to find everything you need here. So the first thing we're going to do is just jump into the education page. Um, once you get here, this will bring you the most recent blog post that's been published on our site under the education category. But over here on the left-hand side, you'll see we have some um, categories that you can just jump into. So if you're just looking for tutorial videos, um, if you're just looking for Koha videos for patrons, if some of you didn't know that we did those, um, mm -hmm. these are specifically made for patrons, not for you know, librarian staff. Um, so feel free to share these with, with anyone. So you can just jump right into these and this will give you, um, you know, the video that you can share or you can embed on your website. Yeah, this is a great, if people don't know these are out there, these are great and I've seen libraries pin them to their OPAC um, and we have a Monday Minutes on how to do that on your OPAC. So we'll link to that back there. But as Jesse was saying, those categories are really helpful. How to are really just anything that we've written a blog post on how to do X, Y, or Z in Koha. And then, but I prefer the search button because you're probably coming to this site to find something really specific and have a question. What should we do a search on, Kelly? Uh, cataloging. Okay. So we do a quick search on cataloging and you'll see again this will bring back any results um, in the system that match uh, cataloging that have a tag so here you can see one there's another Monday minutes on adding a z3950 server what happened in some of those 1911 upgrade notes and then of course going down interlibrary loan advanced keyboard shortcuts now Kelly what if we want to get a little more customized and say maybe something to do with cataloging right yeah, if you were getting into the advanced editor and you want to look about if there was anything about macros. So catalog and macros would probably give you a better hit to what you're looking for. And there we go. There we go. Perfect. 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 And there's a, the town hall on macros. So that, you know, that brings back all of the results. And this one we talked about the new responsive theme for cataloging and some of the options in there. So perfect. Okay, Kelly, tell us about our YouTube channel. So we also have a YouTube channel, which we will do videos from our blog posts and upload them to YouTube. So if you went to YouTube, you can go ahead and search just like you can in um, Bywater Solutions. But I would prefer to, to lead you to like the playlists because we generally like to um, corral those videos to be able to find certain things, like all the videos that are dedicated to Monday Minutes. We have a playlist for Monday Minutes. Mm -hmm. um, any cataloging videos, we have cataloging, which is the second row down. Um, all three of the Mana videos we did will be all together. So it's a great way to find a specific area in cataloging you're working with. I'm sorry, in Koha that you're working with, and then narrow in onto those videos. Because we all know that the videos are short, so you may have to watch a few just because you're trying to get a certain area. Um, and we don't want them to be too long because we don't want to lose your attention. Perfect. And then, you know, once you get into that playlist, you can see the long list of um, videos that are available in there um, where you can easily jump around and, and move in between, as Kelly suggested. Uh, oh, another. Is, look at all the ones we have in admin. Oh, great. You know, yeah, there really are quite a few in there. There are. Um, the other thing we wanted to mention is make sure you subscribe. If you subscribe to the Bywater Solutions channel, um, you'll always get updates on when we've um, put a new video out. So if you just go to youtube.com forward slash user, and then it's just Bywater Solutions, all one word, uh, that will take you right to the site. Um, hit subscribe, and then you'll always get the updates. Um, and one more thing, we also put like all the upgrade webinars. So we have a playlist for each one of the upgrade webinars. So if you weren't able to view those, we like to double up. So there are blog posts and videos, but if you went one one place, you're going to get it and you go to the other place, you'll get it. So we Perfect. hope it works. Um, one more thing, right? Our website? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, 
Jesse had some great feedback from PLA about Monday Minutes, but we want to hear from you all. So if you have an idea for a blog post, tutorial video, please let us know. So we've added an option here. If you hit the contact button, um, where it says subject here, there's a drop down menu. And um, there's an option here where it says suggest tutorial video or blog post. So if there's something that you'd like to see us do, um, come in here, put that subject in, your name and email, um, and then write us a message. Let us know what you'd like to see. Um, no matter what it is, if it's about holds, if it's about, you know, the holds queue or, or whatever it may be, running a report, um, you're getting ready to migrate and you want to, you know, have some information about that, whatever it is, just let us know. And no, no question is too small. We've done a blog post and video on a system preference, so nothing's too small. Yeah. Nothing's too okay. Well, Jesse, this has been great. So I'm, I'm glad we got to show how there are resources out there that Bywater has created and how they can talk to us and let us know what they're looking for. So this is really helpful. Yeah, keep the content flowing. Exactly. Thanks, Jesse. Have a great week. Have a great week, Kelly. See you next week. Bye. Bye.